I ain't y'all. I said if I got some subscribers on this channel, I would do a shop tour. So far we got eight. So here's your shop tour. Before I really start this, I want y'all to keep in mind, this room is eight foot by eight foot. It used to be the back room of our travel trailer. I kind of made me a little office in here. A little leather shop, whatever you want to call it. Holster shop. Anyhow, I'm going to show y'all what I got going on. I'm sitting at my, my work table here. Um, I'm a freight broker also, so that's the reason for the computer. Uh, sitting on my desk. Anyway, to my right hand side, this is the back of the pantry. But it has some of my other stuff on here. Um, some pliers and stuff like that. Those are some attachment clips for holsters for Kydex. Uh, I got some gun boxes up there on the top. These are my leather knives that I use. Uh, it's a head knife. That's a smaller head knife. That's a straight knife and a trim knife. Those knives are extremely sharp. Anyway, this is my work surface. I'm building a holster right now, so all this crap laying on my desk is stuff that I'm using on this holster. Anyhow, I probably should have cleaned up before I did this. I got some little bolts and stuff in the drawers over there in my water. Anyway, y'all know what that is. There's a video on my other channel of that thing. Um, my left side of my desk. I got little wood blocks and stuff in here. I'd be lost with all this. I use for blocking on the holsters and stuff like that. Some rotary tool attachments. Some these are some mold guns and stuff that I have. Uh, and some finishing stuff down here. Y'all know y'all know how I like my roll around toolbox as well. I bought this thing at Big Lot and it is handy. I got some more blocking in the bottom door. Um uh, Allen wrenches and knife blades and flashlights and stuff like that in here. I need this flashlight out anyway. Um some more finishing stuff, some glue applicators, uh a temp gun and some other stuff there. Stuff I use the most in the top drawer. These are my leather stamps. I have a few for tooling leather and stuff. Um, I have my bevelers over here on the wall and my awls and strap cutters and stuff like that. Hole punches, oblong punches. My mallets are up there. I got a compass up there. Anyway, okay. I have a shelf above my desk up here, so we'll go to there, I guess. There are my, my laptops. They're just hooked to the bigger screen. My charger. Uh, I, got, I make handcuff holsters and stuff too for local police, so there's my, my handcuffs that I use. Uh, my wife works in a different office, so we have little two-way radios so we can communicate. I've got some ammo up there and different color dyes and glues. And there's a pink 20-gauge shotgun up there and my caps. Um, and my toaster oven for heating Kydex. I have a, I have a t-shirt press that I use to heat Kydex too. Um, 
that's my in progress handgun holder up there that I got full of hatchets and knives and look at the size of this pocket knife would you look how big that pocket knife is I mean those of you that know me and met me in person I have big hands that thing is huge uh, there's a bunch of crap up there just miscellaneous stuff there's my my different colors of Kydex and my different colors of leather. If you want your sticker on the box, send me a sticker. We got some more leather stamps in there. Uh, that's the, don't everybody have one of these where you put your extra chargers and headphones and all that mess. Uh, Small codex gets thrown in there. Here's another little deal with some garden. That's just got screws and crap in it. Oh, my money and my wallet. Some more blocking stuff. Uh, gloves. I like gloves. I only have one pair, so feel free to send me gloves if you like. There's my heat press. Just a regular t-shirt press. And, you know, I'm a truck driver, so I'm addicted to air conditioning. I have my own air conditioner back here. This is another little deal with some bins in it. I have vinyl stuff down here. Uh, miscellaneous paperwork in that one. My sketch pad. Different kinds of codex in there. Uh, heat gun drill press it has a slicker in it right now for slicking the edges on leather my press for doing this the uh eyelets and codex the big old piece of codex there my wife kind of stole a part of my office here she got clothes hanging in there uh, excuse the mess on the floor, my shoes and stuff. My gun bag, I have most of my guns in, or not most of them, I have some of my guns in. There are guns all over this office. There's four right there. We have a, a Taurus TX-22. Uh, this is one of my everyday carry. Kimber 45 ACP, uh, Mechanic Elite. Anyway, I'm not gonna show y'all my guns, where they're at, cause y'all don't need to know all that. Uh, we'll start doing some live stream and stuff on the other channel, so. There's the camera set up, my headlight. Uh, this is my race rig. Shoot a Canic TP9 SFX. Uh, on a gun belt. There's mags. A little knife in here. Cause you never know when you need a knife. Uh, there's my knife wall. Uh, let's see. There's a couple holsters that I built. I built this for my wife. She really likes it. Um, there's a minimalist holster, another holster I built for my 45, some more guns up there. Um, some Kydex holsters that I've built, experimenting on different things, this, that, and other. <laughs> and my grandson, Zane, I bought those two guns, they shoot little bitty rubber balls. You know, they're like Nerf guns, more or less. And uh, he wanted them hanging on the wall. Well, I said, okay, if I hang them on the wall, you got to give me one of them. So he gave me the little one. But anyhow, this is my life. This is what I do. Beat the hell out of a truck seat. Anyway, hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, hopefully I'll get some views and... Uh, I've missed you guys. I love you guys. And 
Y'all know me. You know what I say. Just bring it.